Hey folks, welcome back to Let's Play Nobunaga's Ambition, Sphere of Influence. I'm Sirius JG. Didn't quite go a full uh, week between play sessions. I uh, played the game last night, felt like playing it today. Here we go. I'm in great danger of getting way far ahead. So, who knows, maybe I'll start putting up two videos a day or something. But, it's all good. And, um, we've gotten out of war and into... Uh, Chicago, no, we haven't. We've gotten out of war and into domestics, but uh, I have a feeling that war will be coming back fairly soon, which is um, one of the reasons we need to do the best that we can with our domestics. Now, I'm going to be honest with you guys. I um, the end of my last play session, I played around a little bit, not recording, just zipping through turns to make sure that I knew which quest was coming and. Uh, I've been talking about the dangers of building up cities too much when the plot might just snatch them away. And, well, yeah. It was a legitimate fear to have. And, uh, as a matter of fact, I'm so, I've gotten so far ahead. There he is with this uh, tea set. Ready to explode. But I'm so far ahead now of, uh, of what's posted that, um... You guys may have been giving me, like, people who know the game better than I do may have been giving me spoiler-filled warnings about don't do too much with Narumi, don't do too much with Okagi, but I haven't heard them, so please don't feel like I'm just dumb or can't read or I'm not reading the comments. It's just that in certain cases I, uh, had already taken actions so that couldn't be reversed. There's like a, looks like there's a boat floating around out there. Oh no, those are armies. They're armies of the night. So anyway, yeah, we've hit this uh, state now where I'm actually going to move my officers. Um, well, I kind of want to move them out of there. I, I don't think I actually lose. I think the officers, I don't think I actually need to literally move the officers out. If there was a way to move the troops out of there, I would, but... Um, I think you just lose them. Pretty sure when the plot takes those cities from me, I just lose the troops that were there. It's a shame. We're moving out, and we're winning this. We're winning this day trip to Suomori. I'm just gonna see what happens with that. Um, but yeah, I think these cities are all full up. Suomori. Sumor can hold a little bit more than it's got now, but not much. And it certainly won't be able to hold all the troops that are marching out of there. Otherwise, there's been a lot of... Um, well, there's been a lot of um, building going on to get uh, annexes and residences in my castle, so they'll grow faster, but... Other than building up Suomori itself, future home of Nobunaga, there's not too much for me to do. And I actually can't build that up. I built it up as much as I could. Who's the overseer? Now, we should have Nobu Hide as the overseer until... Um, at least until we reach the point that... Um, We need him to be doing something else. But all these cities now can advance more than they were able to mere moments ago because of um, increased. Uh, well, the facilities are like? different. I got rid of the farmers' markets and stuff, and thank you very much. Started buying horses what and treasures like? and whatnot. Thank you very much. I guess I've done what I can with the Imperial Court. I could start doing diplomacy. Not sure who I would want to do it with. The um, Imagawa are dismissive of my weak influence. They treat me with scorn, and frankly, um, I don't really have much of a um, 
get trust going with the Azai. These guys are vassals. Our Chicago clan seems uh, interested. I mean, I could start building trust with forces, but I don't have any... Um, don't have anything in particular that I want to do with any of these forces. I mean, it wouldn't be bad to have a bank of trust with forces like the... Uh, I'll be fighting the Takata eventually. It wouldn't be a bad idea to have a bank of trust with certain clans, but... No, I mean, the ones that are really far away, I've got no particular reason to talk to them. And I want to give you guys a chance to weigh in on who should become the Lord of Bungo and all that stuff. So I guess we can just end our turn. We're going to have a lot of turns that are just getting ended. We keep this path into fighting with the Matsudaira clan. Avoid unnecessary fighting. How about a detour? No, just go right through. You're actually not attacking them, so they shouldn't care. Finally, some action! We march! And they did come out to check and see what's going on, because we were in their territory, but then they stopped. Now they're coming into my territory, but uh, they're still not... Um, Katsue Shibata entered his unit soldiers returned to their base. I don't see I mean I don't understand how to transfer troops then. I really don't. Did they end up back here? No, this place is down to one fifty six again. Did they just disappear off the face of the earth? Or is it going to take them some time to return to that base and then they'll suddenly pop up? Got more battles and clans going down. Yeah, it looks like those troops were just swallowed. Let's begin the meeting. Here is last month's balance. Reporting in. What would you like? So those guys were seriously completely destroyed. Thank they you just very much. ceased to be. There's room for all sorts of stuff there because we never built up that castle, but there's a reason. Yeah, the the troops just vanished. So I don't get that, and uh, I'm not going to start getting it in time for it to help. Because I think there's more plot stuff coming. Well, I know there is. These cities will be ours soon enough. Might as well get somebody working on that. Might as well be you. There goes all of our money. And now I can just really concentrate on uh, letting it build better. But I would love to know what happened to those troops. 
Booking it all in advance like that just uh, kind of saves labor, but not cash. Fusufuya Ichijo is dead and has been replaced by Fusamata Ichijo. Here is last month's balance. Yeah, spent a lot of money on infrastructure there, in. building up all the roads in the history of the world. But eventually get to the point where the core of the Oda territory will just have, like, you know, bullet trains. It really is going to be, like, super Japanese. Um, with, you know, bullet trains and all. Uh, large garden. I never did take that thing down. I just figured I'd stick with uh, something kind of uh, unique-ish. there's a better way to do that. I know there is. People have sent in comments. Uh, the village and an inn. It's almost tempting to do something here that affects multiple areas, but I'm happy with the, the inn the way it is. I know I spent a lot on infrastructure, but we can still continue to build Thank up our giant much. horse army. I don't know. I, I know from uh, tracking conversations in the comments that the number of horses you have doesn't need to match your soldier count and your unit one for one um, in order to have a cavalry unit. But I am... I don't know exactly what the number is. I, I'm thinking now I might have 16,000 horses. I think I've got more horses than I've got troops. So, I um, hadn't really thought about that until just now. I'm basically banking horses for the future. Future horses. Um, yeah. What the hell happened to the troops that were in Katsuwe's unit then? Doesn't make sense. Hojo are uh, taking dudes out. Guy I don't care about is having a secret meeting. Hirotara Matsudaira, a minor daimyo ruling over Mikawa, was under the protection of Yoshimoto Imagawa, the daimyo of Suruka. As proof of his loyalty to Yoshimoto, Hirotara sent his eldest son and heir, Takichio, to the Imagawa clan. However, on his way to Yoshimoto, an unforeseen disaster befell Takichio. What happened to Hiratara's son? It appears someone betrayed us and handed him over to Nobuhide Oda. Do they have no shame? Yet perhaps it was our fault for putting him in the hands of people we could not trust. The power of money is strong, my lord. The reports say the men sold Takichio to Nobuhide. Nobuhide, whatever. Money, so that's how Nobuhide operates. Indeed, therefore we must use our own methods. I vow to bring back Takachio personally. Nobuhide had better watch out now that he's angered my master. I am a servant of the Buddha. It is my duty to root out evil. I will show Nobuhide that the world has not fallen so low as to overlook those who would sell a child to their enemy, even for a sack of gold. Sack on gold. I don't know who I'm scared of more, the demons in hell or you. I'm gone, my lord. Oh, okay. Well, that's why I can say that openly. Nobuhide's unorthodox plan to steal Takachiyo Matsudaira away by buying out the warriors guarding him ended in success. However, taking Takachiyo as a hostage was not enough to make Hirotara Matsudaira bow to the Oda clan. to think that Hirotara would be this stubborn. I can scarcely believe in myself. 
I suppose his Makawa warrior dutifulness will not allow him to betray Yoshimoto. What will we do with his son, my lord? Take care of the child. We'll be able to make use of him someday. Make use of him. Yoshimoto will likely come back for the boy. Put Nobuhiro in Ancho. Lord Nobuhiro, my lord? He should be able to handle a defending Ancho, and I can't imagine him taking Mikawa. Kiposhi, however, might have a chance. When will we change the young master's name, my lord? When his marriage has been settled, Masahide, move negotiations along with the fighter. Randy Orton, we will have to give up Ogaki. Is that permissible, my lord? Give it to them, because Kiposhi? No, Nobunaga will take it right back. Ah, shit, I should have moved the troops out of uh, that city, too. Oh, I saw chime. Bring the Saito clan's trust up to 100 in a year. Nobuhiro Oda protects Ansho Castle for one year. What an energetic kid. Oh, I've got it. He'll be Nobukane when he comes of age. My liege, your retainer, Toshihisa Meida, has adopted a son. He'll be named Keiji when he comes of age. And he'll be this, like, weird blonde kid, like, freaky dude... Let's in the begin Samurai the Warriors game. Awesome. So, uh, although I'm spending money like water on horses, we actually and infrastructure, we actually are still making more than we're spending. Reporting in. Nobunori Sakuma is acting kind of crazy, and other things are happening as well. Now we need Ancho needs to not fall. March a bunch of troops out of there, but I think that'll be okay. Also of note, there's no point in Ogaki having troops in it right now. Let's go. So we want them um, somewhere else because we're about to hand this city over, and I believe the troops that are there will go over to the enemy force. What would you like? Don't have enough gold for treasure right now. Well, I mean, I could buy the cheaper of the two, but forget it. Are you the best overseer we got? Yeah, I'm moving my really good political officer somewhere else. Mainly here. Don't remember seeing anything about being able to do anything else with um, castle structures. This we're basically in uh, enemy territory there. I mean, I could improve these roads just to make moving about in my own territory easier, but I think uh, I'm already building up roads around cities I don't hold yet, just so that they'll start out with the maximum advantages. Suomori Castle's workshop can be changed. Okay. Nobody seems to have freaked out too much about Lu Bu being on the march. Something strange is going on around Shigaharu Kuoyama. Do be wary of his betrayal and defection. We march! Are you actually going to attack that city? Nope. Oh, hey, that's, um... Who that man? It's, uh... Raiden Weissman. He's got two non-created guys with him. But yeah, that's Raiden. He's out there, uh... Raiden, I'll take care of it. Keep an eye on Lu Bu. Which seems, uh, like a good thing to do if you've got Lu Bu anywhere near your territory. He just doesn't seem that trustworthy, you know? I have uh, posted far enough and read enough comments to know. People have pointed out a few things in combat. A, I keep zooming in on every battle. Not every battle, but most battles. That's not necessary. And um, I might start doing that less frequently. Although there's a plot battle coming up, I think where we'll probably have to, you know, set this tactics and not just strategy. Uh, but this thing where, where units deploy every time I'm wandering around, uh, and I keep thinking, oh, you... Uh, 
don't have troops in your city, so now they're going to take advantage of an opportunity to attack. Uh, no, people have pointed out, and I think it, it holds true. It, I didn't just take people's word for it straight off the bat. I thought about it, and it made sense. That the... Um, this is basically this unit's here to keep an eye out and like to be prepared to fight Lubu's unit if it moves against the Saito. It's, it's a defensive unit. It's not intended to attack. Although you never know what's going to happen. See, they're, they're heading back home. Muted info, enter. Understood. So it's just gonna sit there? Yep. Yeah. And now if I tell it to enter. What I keep seeing is those troops vanish, because they can't all fit in Suomori. But it doesn't push Suomori up to its maximum pop, it just they just vanish. And now Lu Bu no longer has a castle, so let's check on his loyalty. Katsuie is uh, discontent on occasion. He's got a treasure. Hopefully things will get better once some plot stuff occurs. He's barely where he needs to be. Somebody's working on these guys, and that's whatever. Although, I'll tell you, it's some of these guys, like, uh, this guy right here has really good stats. He's currently Lord of a Castle. Somebody's trying to work on making him uh, a malcontent. And uh, I might want to give him treasure the next time we get to a domestic turn. Just coming up shortly. Your orders. Here's Lesmond's balance. Reporting in. Stats are good. His stats are okay. Stats are okay. We need to keep him for historical reasons. This guy's stats are actually excellent. Um... Horses forever. So that was not it. This was what we wanted. Uh, so I don't remember which facility it is that we can expand. Orchard is a terminal, I have to remember that. And by terminal, I mean it's the closing brain. It's the closing piece on that tree of things you can build. I think it was a workshop or something that could be expanded. Ah, here we are. Hachimangu. Well, I'll go with theater for now. Might be nice to expand that later to change that to something else, but that'll. But you know, theaters I I, I try to build when I can. Which basically I can build them anytime I have that type of district. So I might not be having like the absolute optimal uh, build for some of my stuff, but you know what? We'll be okay. Um, I know we need to start working on diplomacy with the uh, Saito. No, not the Imperial Court. This. No. Not the Azai either. Oh, we've got, um. I guess we'll have, uh. 
Nobuhide do it personally since he's uh, arranging f uh, his son's marriage. But in fact, the person who I would have had doing that is... Uh, oh, so we got a... Got a new person in place quickly. person who should have been working that was, uh, I don't even remember her name now, Jaina. Uh, but she's um, busy building roads. Another clan eliminated by another clan. Charlton Jaina. She only Let's negotiates with the Imperial Court. She won't lower herself to talk to Saito. Here is last month's balance. Reporting in. There's some Ronin in our lands, the Ronin Warriors. So we'll just keep on adding warriors to our force. Again, we don't really have anything to do with all these officers, but I'm hoping we'll eventually... And it is Nobunaga's story. I'm hoping eventually we'll have a fairly rapid uh, expansion. Ask for anything sanctioned you by the story. How many... How many actual troops have we got? We have 20,000 soldiers and 16,000 horses. And I know that it's not one for one when you need horses, but Thank you for your patronage. I think we can afford to buy Oh no, I couldn't have, shouldn't have done that at all. Shit, I didn't notice how much money that cost. <laughs> that was That was dumb. Shouldn't have done that. Okay. Well, that being the case, we are not going to, I guess, develop anything this turn. I just need to pay more attention to my cash. So I've talked to the Psycho, the Psycho Clan. Psycho Clan. <laughs> yeah, we have to keep negotiating. We're trying to get a marriage going here. Let's begin the meeting. Here is last month's balance. Reporting in. Okay. They want me to do something here, so it seems. Yeah, orchard. That is going to increase various other districts. And make them better at doing more than one thing. It's going to be awesome. It will basically raise the maximum output of that city. Like this one, I might want to change that from a rice dealer to something that, you know, when fully upgraded will increase, because it's going to increase five different thieves. Or not thieves, but... Uh, how do they describe it? Districts, yes. Like eventually, uh... Crops and crafts, yeah. Eventually I'm going to have a nice little district. Better know a district. Several nice districts, I should say. You know, I had a full night's sleep and um, even have a cup of tea in me, so I'm not flagging. I'm still not making any sense. Now, this place, I don't know if it it can grow any bigger, so it might be wise to eventually get rid of that rice dealer, but I don't think it's a problem. There may come a point where I have to put those cities on auto and disable uh, the AI's ability to change the districts and just allow them to develop. And that way I won't have to manually select it. We need to continue working a Saito, yes. You know the quest just as well as I do. Let's begin the meeting. Let's begin Here's the beginning. Last month's balance. Reporting in. Garth has gotten even better. Wayne will be thrilled. This is uh, staying lit up with a little balloon because they want me to build. Um, one more castles have no lord. What are you talking about? Oh, Lubu was alone in Ogaki Castle. Well, you know what we could do is we could um, pick somebody who's just pissed off temporarily, like you. Or you, you're an overseer. Uh, 
And you actually... No, you have better stats. Let's move you over there. And uh, then... We'll need a better overseer... Uh, wherever he was actually in charge. Which I think might have been here. Yeah, there's nobody there with good pull. Uh, with Katsuie over there. He'll actually have the best pull of those guys. Now yeah, we'll move you instead. Damn, you got a hundred pull, buddy. You're pretty good. Snake. Alright. What would you like? So what... Yeah, I don't know if there's horses for a premium or I just bought a whole bunch of horses that one time, but I'm going to have to hold my horses. <laughs> Should be a better overseer than you available, no offense. Uh, no, you're right about the top. Won't make much difference. I guess uh, Nobuhide is back to building, uh, is building roads and stuff, and I moved um, the person with a hundred pole away. thing is, these cities, this is like the core of the Oda territory. I will never lose any of these cities unless uh, I'm basically at a point where we're in a critical uh, place, potentially losing the entire game. So even if it's like these tiny little incremental improvements, they will be in our force. Any improvements we, we make will pay for themselves. We will get positive return on them. Um, and uh, now it's time to call the video. So, I'm going to do just that. When we come back, um, I know it's not the most exciting thing to watch. Matter of fact, I might just put Suomori in. I want to keep an eye on the messages so I can periodically go in and do things, but if we put Suomori and Nagoya on um, manual and just disable everything except um, develop, uh, we could be in a good place. So we'll see about that next time. I'm the Mysterious JG. Thank you very much for watching. And um, we're, uh, we should have wedding bells in the future. Everybody um, check the registry for uh, the Demon King, Nobunaga, and uh, the, the Viper's daughter, Lady No, who, if you know her from Samurai Warriors, is like this really kind of like dark, fucked up chick <laughs> who's a good match for like dark, fucked fucked up Nobunaga. Don't know if that's how it'll be portrayed in this game, but uh, I'm thinking in the next video there may be wedding bells. Um, and if not, there will be plenty of uh, domestic development. Bye-bye.